Et c'est aussi Thomas Marial, responsable du développement social et mis en place la famille. Élu conseillère de la ville de Parc de Parc Extension depuis 1988, Marie Véros est présidente du conseil consultatif d'urbanisme et de l'arrondissement. Elle a été membre du comité exécutif de la ville responsable des sports, des loisirs, du développement social et des quartiers sensibles. Elle a confié la responsabilité des communautés d'origine diverse au comité exécutif. Au prix des communautés d'origine diverse, elle mise sur son expérience dans le domaine public pour améliorer la qualité de vie de ses concitoyens. J'invite Mme Mérilleros à la salle, s'il vous plaît. Il me fait grand plaisir de participer ici ce soir. Et je suis, comme Justin l'avait dit, très impressionnée et très heureuse de voir la communauté tamoule, mais la génération qui a été née ici à Montréal et la génération qui est plus jeune qui va prendre leur élève. Je suis impressionnée par l'organisation. Félicitations. I too would like to welcome the uh, guests that have arrived from Toronto. And uh, although I've heard about the Canadian Tamil Congress, I have not had a chance to meet and discuss different issues with the community. Uh, my very first um, activity with the Tamil community was in 99 when I went to the Durkaman Temple, which is in Park Extension, for the Chariot Festival. And I was uh, quite impressed by the procedures by the religion procession and by the followers. You are a very vibrant community and today you show this vibrancy with the young people who are here tonight. In the past I've mentioned to some of the organizations in Parkex to meet with the young people to talk about the different opportunities that the city of Montreal offers and we've met a few but I like what I see here tonight and I will also give you my invitation to sit down with you and talk about all the opportunities that there are within the city. Whether it's the Mayor's Foundation for Youth, whether it's a program where you can have a six month paid stage with the city, or if you're in high school you can have summer jobs within the city and we will train you. There's a whole lot of interesting opportunities. But you know, Justin talked about social justice. The city of Montreal is very proud of the charter of rights and responsibilities of its citizens, where every Montreal citizen has equal rights to all services, to respect and to live equally and in harmony, just as their neighbors. And this particular Charter of Rights is being translated in many languages. It would be nice to have it translated into Tamil. I know also that United Nations is looking at it as a model example to export to other international cities. We are very proud of our achievements. We are very proud of our close to 150 different cultural communities that live in Montreal, that live in Harmony, despite our differences back home. And I know that you have your issues. I've lived them with you. We've cried together. We've spent candlelight vigils in the rain, in the snow, to remember those who have died, martyrs, and to have the social justice and to also have justice and peace and have closure, and I understand that. And I hope that eventually there will be peace, <coughs> not just peace in Sri Lanka, but peace all over the world. When I was looking at the images yesterday on television of the tsunami that hit Japan, I thought way back when tsunami hit Sri Lanka not the west coast of Sri Lanka, the east coast where you country people were, and it was a devastation. And I remember the efforts, the fundraising efforts, 
and the different lobbying with the governments to try to see what can be done to help your country people. And it was reliving the tragedy all over again. I can only say that we should pray together so that natural disasters such as this cease. But then we cannot control what happens naturally with nature. What we can control is how we live in harmony, in peace with our neighbors and with each other. Coming back to today's events and tonight's wonderful organization, I'm very happy, very pleased and proud that the youth and the chapter, the Montreal chapter of CTC has organized tonight's event with such success. You can count on my continued support and you can count on my being your liaison with the city of Montreal to continue in giving you the right to have your events on our streets, your celebrations in our parks and in our community centers. And I will help and guide you so you can do so with pride. One thing I want to congratulate also, and I must highlight this, is the way you encourage your young people through their excellence in their studies and also in track and field and sporting events. I've often been there, whether it was at Claude Robillard in Saint Laurent or at Jerry Park, when many of you have ran and have competed against each other for different events and you've been encouraged by your peers to excel not only in studies, in your, in your education, but also in well-being through sports. Congratulations on all your efforts. I'm very proud of you. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful evening.